Father Andrew, there's a new update on the Bible. Should we update it? That's a good question. What are you hoping to be update? Careful other people. Ah, like careful. social justice. Social justice. To, well, I'm just going to draw some people there. Uh, we'll see if that's in there. What else do you, are you hoping for? Caring for the environment. Environment. I'm just going to draw a tree. What else? I hope it's easy to understand. Easy to understand. Okay. Easy. I'm just going to write easy. What else? It should be timeless. Timeless. Okay. I think that's the right spelling. What else? And I don't want it to treat me like I'm an idiot. Okay. Not like an idiot. I'll see what I can do. Not an idiot. Okay. What else are we hoping for in there? Modern language. Modern. 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 Okay. Yeah. Modern language. Well, being serious about the question you ask, girls, a lot of the stuff's already in there. I mean, there's already a lot of social justice stuff in the Bible. And sometimes we need some work kind of understanding it. Uh, but it's still in there. And, and obviously a lot of the environmental stuff, well, that's actually still in there too. There's a care for the environment and those sorts of things. Now the easy and not an idiot, a little bit tricky, I know. But if you think about it, a lot of the stories young kids can understand. But as you get older and older, you learn that there's more in there. So, as difficult as it is to understand, they're both already in there. And the stuff about timeless and modern language, it's a little unfair, but I actually reckon that's my job to help you understand. So it's my job to take the timeless stuff and to translate it into the modern language stuff. So should you update? No, I reckon not yet. It's all there, the stuff you're looking for.